Hey everybody, greetings from Boston. I've got some big news as well as a good excuse for not uploading more videos last spring, but first, I'd like to thank all of you who showed up for the premiere of William Blake Rhapsody on the New York Phil Biennial. It truly was a joy to hear Lucy Shelton and the New York Philharmonic perform a piece I've been working on for over 14 years on what was arguably the most important new music festival the New York Philharmonic has done in decades. And it meant so much to me that so many of you wished me so many kind thoughts and that dozens of you actually came to the concert, so I want to thank you for that. So you ready for the news? I am the new chair of the string department of Berklee College of Music in Boston. So what does that mean? What does the chair of Berklee College's string department actually do? Well, for starters, Berklee expects me to continue to be an artist of national stature, which means I need to keep performing, composing, recording, teaching, and so that I'm actually living the kind of career that the graduates might want to live and leading by example. Work it. I'll be working alongside a string faculty of 15 of the coolest musicians you could ever hope to meet and we'll be mentoring well over 200 students who are pursuing performance, education, music business, music therapy, and all kinds of other possible careers that Berkeley offers. Work it, man! I'll be working to determine the course and repertoire and direction of Berkeley's ensembles and orchestras. I'll be working together with a team of over 30 other Berkeley department chairs, deans, and administrators to design curriculum, craft the vision for Berkeley's future, and try to ensure that our students receive the best contemporary music education in the world. And I'll be working with Berkeley summer programs to run one of the world's premier eclectic summer string programs. In fact, just last night we wrapped up the 2014 Mark O'Connor Berkeley College summer string program. All week long we've been having classes, lessons, jam sessions, groove orchestras, and two or three faculty concerts a night in state-of-the-art facilities and local venues and last night we had a student showcase concert which you would not believe. And our faculty members treat our students as colleagues. In the summer program we are jamming alongside them in the orchestra or in ensembles or in the public evening concerts and after hours in jam sessions and that's often where the real learning takes place. As a matter of fact, last night we were up till about 3 in the morning having our own jam session with some Berkeley students and uh, it was a lights out freeform jam that went everywhere from these sonic explorations to uh, psychedelic renditions of the Beatles' Norwegian Wood to some bebop stuff and it just lasted about three or four hours just almost non-stop with different people coming in the room and joining in. If you were at this year's camp, you know what I'm talking about. You can comment on that and come back next year because it's only going to get better. And if you haven't been here, well, check out the website, link in the description, so that next year you can sign up and join the jam. I'll definitely be working. So I know a lot of you viewers are eclectic string players who like to rock, who like to jam, who like chamber music, who like electronics, who like to fiddle, who like traditional, who like classical, who like everything that has strings. And I need to see you in a couple years auditioning. And I want to see you in our summer string program. Yeah, I'm talking to you, Brianna. I'm talking to you, Estefan. I'm talking to you, Edic. You too, MK. You too, Alyssa. And you. And you, Tanner. And you, Grace. And all you harbingers of awesomeness. Man, there's so many names I can't get everybody. Big, I just wanted to say congratulations on the new position of Berkeley <laughs> and the Blackman there. <laughs> I really think it's fantastic. I can't wait to see what happens. Yeah. So check this out. This is Quincy Jones's letter of inquiry to be a student at Berkeley College of Music and there is his application. And that's just about directly over my new office. Pretty cool, huh?